Hi everybody. Welcome back to my blog again. Um, today is rather special uh, because as you know, um, the 90th uh, Academy Award um, uh, ceremony had just recently uh, concluded um, on Sunday and I want to talk about a particular award for best cinematography. Uh, a particular cinematographer by the name of Roger Dickens, okay? Um, what I understand is that Roger Dickens has been nominated for the Academy Award 13 times so far, okay? And uh, it has been quite a re remarkable uh, journey for him for, uh, for the fact that um, for the past 12 nominations that had, he had received, uh, basically, um, he lost. Uh, to be honest, he lost to uh, mo a lot of great movies, yeah, out there. Okay, I just want to give a little brief, a little brief about Roger Dickens. Who he is? Okay, Roger Dickens is basically an um, he is an Engl an accomplished English cinema cinematographer. Okay, best known for his uh, work on films by the likes of Coen Brothers, Sam Mendes. Uh, and Dennis Villeneuve, okay, and um, he is the member of both the American Brit and British Society of Cinematographers, okay, and he have received the 2011 American Society of Cinematographers uh, Award or, or the Lifetime Achievement Awards. And uh, what I want to basically touch, in particular, is his journey through the Oscars okay um, let me just go through um, this nomination he has received in total of 13 nomination for the Oscars okay starting from 1995 whereby he received the nomination for the movie Shawshank Redemption okay and and then he lost it to John Toll for the movie Legends of the Fall, and then in 1997, okay, he uh, was nominated for Fargo, okay, and then he lost it to John Seal for the movie The English Patient, and then in 1998, he, he was nominated for Kundun, okay, and then um, he lost it to Russell Carpenter for the movie Titanic. It's a quite good. It's a great movie, okay. And then in 2011, he was again nominated for the fourth time uh, for Oh Brother Where Art Thou, uh, which he then lost to Peter Pao for the movie Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon, okay. And then for the fifth time, he was nominated for the movie called Other Man Who Wasn't There in 2002, but then he lost to Andrew Lesney for. Lord, Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Rings. Okay, for in 2008, sorry, mind, he has two nominations. First of all, Assassination of Jesse James by the coward Robert Ford and No Country for Older Men. And he still lost to Robert Elswit for the movie There Will Be Blood. And then uh, he was nominated in 2009 for the movie The Reader, which actually you can actually see is playing in the background there <laughs> at the moment. I'm actually rewatching it again. Okay, uh, for The Reader, Roger, Disky, Roger Dickens lost yet again. Okay, and this time to Anthony Dot Mantel. Mental, okay, for the movie Slum Dog Millionaire. It's a great movie. Okay, and then in 2011, he was nominated. He got the nomination for True Grit and then lost to Wally Feister for the movie Inception, which is also another great movie. I love that movie. Okay, and then uh, in 2013, he made a James Bond movie called Skyfall, which is so great. But again, he lost it to Claudio. Claudio Miranda for the movie Life of Pi. Okay, and then in 2014, uh, he was nominated for the movie Prisoners, but lost to Emmanuel Lubezki for Gravity. Okay, here this is here comes the uh, interesting part. Okay, from 2014, he lost to Gravity uh, to 
Emmanuel Lubezki and then in 2015 he was nominated for the movie Unbroken but lost it to Birdman again cinema cinema the cinematographer was Emmanuel Lubezki so and then in 2016 he was nominated for Sicario and then lost for the third time to Emmanuel Lubezki for the movie Revenant so for 2014 2015 and 2016 concert, concert, consecutively he has lost to the same uh, person yes uh, which is Emmanuel Lubezki who has uh, gotten the uh, honors or the record of winning three consecutive Oscar for the same category three times in a row okay at last in 2018 okay he, Roger Dickens was nominated for the movie Blade Runner 2049 okay and guess what finally finally he won the Oscar on his 13th attempt okay so um so i i would say this is a uh, 13th time the lucky charm for mr dickens okay and uh, i would like to congratulate uh, roger dickens for his oscar win uh, and uh, for the academy's uh, recognition um for his work in blade runner 2049 uh, but to be fair um looking at the uh, the list of the past uh, oscar winners uh, they are great movies okay um it's quite tough basically competing with uh, a lot of great movies okay again it's a well deserved win uh, for mr roger dickens congratulations this goes to shows that um to anybody out there to everybody out there persistence perseverance um and doing what you love and keep doing and keep moving and keep doing and keep crushing it um constantly you know um uh, and never to give up i personally takes this as a form of uh, inspiration um to keep on doing until i get or achieve what i want so to you guys out there to you girls out there too persevere don't give up don't give up on your dreams no matter what people say just do it okay so um with that i thank you for staying this long and uh, watching my video okay please do not forget to like and subscribe and please press the um notification bell there so that you will not miss um my my new videos uh my upcoming videos thank you for watching leave your comments let me know uh, uh what are your thoughts and uh okay we'll catch you on the next one bye and thank you for watching